How's it going, boys? Today we are playing a Gideon Infinity deck. Oh, yes. A Gideon. Who would have ever thought, right? But it's true. We are going to be using Gideon for a change. So, this is the good old combo Pact of Negation Gideon plus Chance for Glory Gideon. Only thing is we're kind of making this into an Infinity Engine. So, there you go. So, 4 Fat Pact of Negation, 4 Rewhite Lies, 4 Fey of Fishes, 2 Search for a Scone, 4 Shimmers of Possibility, 3 Gideons of the Trials, 4 Chances of Glory, 2 Siddle Dine Wreckage, 4 Doom Scars, 4 Mirari Conjecture, and a bunch of lands. 4 Fable Passages, 24 lands to be specific. And a sideboard. Grab Diggers, Sorcerer's Spyglass, Cleanse the Mind, Vrats, Mythos of Elune, Into the Story, and, well, pretty much that's honestly mo more or less it. But anyway, that's the deck. It's pretty interesting, it's a little bit fun, it's a little bit of this, a little bit of that. So without any further ado, boys, let's just get a cracking and see what happens now, shall we? Also, thank you for the people who pressed the subscribe button and the bell icon you are the best and so are the patreons obviously my boys okay we found our first opponent this is gonna be an easy one the soulless avatar easy okay let's see reasonable reasonable not reasonable and yeah all day today when i'm playing magic it's pretty much just being a poker star Two, uh, two plus two, three of a kind, like, l l literally all of that good stuff. And by good stuff, I obviously mean I dislike it a lot. Uh, but yeah, can't do anything about it. Life is life. What are you gonna do about it? Okay, we got a Doom Scar, which is good. Well, there goes the Doom Scar. Or Fey of Fishes. Kinda depends. Obviously, this is some kind of, uh, gonna sacrifice things kind of deck. Revitalize? Seriously, enemy con. Why? Does that heart inspire so much fear into you? Really? Because, you know, I still have a third, uh, third whatever play. So, yeah. Not gonna pop the Fable Passage. No reason to pop it just yet. Well, actually, it depends on what he does here. Maybe he drops something. Maybe he doesn't. It looks like he doesn't. What am... What, what, what? Okay. Okay, so this is, uh, what you might call it, Tybalt deck. Okay. Well, that Fey of Fishes was mine, but technically I don't exactly care too much. So there you go. Okay, got this. Uh, do I want to, uh, do I want to wait a little bit longer? Probably not. There's a chance for us to get a Gideon, which kind of like, you know, ma ma main objective of the game, to be honest. Okay, let's see. Do nothing. Do I want to maybe Doomscar? Mm, I have fear. Yeah, let's just Doom Scar. If nothing happens next turn, we at least can use Fey of Fishes and get something out of the deck. That probably does nothing. We could target uh, Tybalt, Cosmic Imposter, and then Enemy Kun would be like, No! Why me? Cruel, cruel reality! Also, you know, if we Sorcerer's Spyglass, that. Hello there! What you doing there, champ? Okay, very interesting. Not really. Um, okay. I would love to have a Gideon right about now. Oh, it's not a Gideon. Wow. What, what, what a play. Okay, what's even remotely useful here? Uh, let me think. Um, well, it starts with nothing and it kind of rhymes with probably nothing. Great. Okay, well, it could be worse. Oh, wait. No, wait. No, yeah, it could not be worse. <clears throat> oh, Fable Passage, Enemy Kun. Are you trying to let me cast into the story? That's so cutesy. I love it. Well, that there goes the Mirari Conjecture. Okay, this is great. Oh, he had that. Well, I guess it's fine. Okay, I'm gonna drop the Fey of Fishes. Let's see what Enemy Kun decides to do. He's obviously pressing the Liliana button, but he's also obviously pressing the Kill Fey of Fishes button. Okay, does he even have creatures in here? I think he only has Tybalt, so what's the exact... Oh, oof, ah. Ew. Wait, that's actually a direct counter to my deck. Huh. Okay. Not cool. Uh, 
graveyard, I guess. Transform, yeah, why not? Get, get a little bit of that damage dealt. Search for a bunch of cards. Okay, we found a Gideon. The only problem is we kind of need to, well, make Chandra not exactly life-threatening. Also, enemy con... Oh, wait, wait he, do he did it! The absolute madman! Oof! What are you gonna do? Take my fate of wishes? Ah, that's that's cute, enemy con. That's that's real. That's real hunky, peachy, dory cutie. Okay, so the problem is simple, right? Can I actually win off of this point? We have the Gideon. We have the stuff. We 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 we, we have what it takes. But can we win? What do, you, what do you think is the last card in the deck? Okay, I can like. I can easily do this. Yeah, I can easily do this. No problemos whatsoever. Ah, not that. Please. Ah. Nope. 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 Not today, boys. Ah. Uh, okay, you have a Chandra. V a a very cool. Oh! Oh, look at that. Okay, so I'm Fay of Wishing. Wait, maybe I actually did a little bit more. Disgusting. Uh, wait, he's just gonna do this- OH, HE JUST DOES THAT AGAIN! That's unfair! Yeah, that seems a little bit unfair! Completely did not forget about it, by the way. Yeah, that seems a little bit unfair, uncalled for even. You know, questionable to say the least. Okay, uh, Fable Passage, not the first draw here, it thins out the deck at least. Okay, let me think a little bit here. How many Mirari's conjectures did we actually sack? Two or three? Oh, that's the that's the number three. That is not the good the good type of number. Okay, so here's this. I am so dead, by the way. I I honestly don't think there's a lot I can do here. Let's not forget about the Gideon emblem. Technically. Nah, technically nothing actually works, huh? Well, taking a little bit of that sweet, sweet flabbergaster damage damage. Oof, very cool. Okay, well, not not the worst case scenario. Again, can make Gideon into a human. He wasn't previously, FYI. Okay, what what are our options? We have one more turn left. We can obviously do this. Not gonna achieve a lot, but... Technically, usually- Oh, Mirari's Conjecture. That actually solves a couple of my issues. Not my crippling loneliness and depression in general. Oh, but it does solve some issues of this game, which is, hey, better than nothing, boys. Better than nothing. Okay, that's- that's- that's very good. Can't actually tell how many turns I have left here, but that's absolutely uh, squeaky-peaky. Let me think. Yeah, I need to get rid of this, no matter what. The good part is, do we actually have enough? Uh, I can't- I don't- I don't even know how this works! Okay, it's fine. It's- 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 it's, it's fine, boys. It's- it's 100% fine. Okay, get, get an extra turn. Uh, do the Gideon thing, yet again. Okay, the problem is, he can kill my- my, my Gideon. Which is a problem. Again, kind of annoying. Actually, no, maybe he can't kill the Gideon. Okay, let me use my brain for a second. I feel a little bit uh, of pain, but honestly, nothing more. Okay, let me think. So, um... Wait, can I just double it up? Yes, I technically can. Okay, let Okay, okay, this is this is fine. So we do this. Right? The play of the century, the man of the hour, the tower of power. Gideon slaps Chandra. You know, because he's into that type of st stuff. Definitely look at that side beard, boys. You 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 know Gideon's there. Okay, do this. Okay, great. Get Faith Vicious back. That was the main objective. No, actually. Wait, why did I need to kill? Wait, why did I need to kill the the, the tit? Oh, wh 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 why? Why did I need to actually do that? 
Eh. Annoying. Okay, okay. So now the game is literally called Protect Gideon or Die Trying. Most likely Die Trying. It is what it is. I didn't make the rules. I just kind of follow them a lot and make them at. Uh oh. Uh oh. Good game. I have still have a revitalize my little pea brain, uh, whatever you're uh, you're called. I still have a revitalize. Yes. Watch this, baby boo. Watch. Ching. Oh, I'm sorry. I. Wait, is this not proc yet? Dude, is this seriously not proc yet? Well, whatever. Okay, revive- <laughs> Oh, that's useful. Thank you, game. I exactly wanted the cliff whatever retreat. Wow. Such game. But I can always- Stop deck and giddy in my- Oh, I can play it. I actually can play it. Sugoi! What now? Overwhelming skill. Overwhelming talent. I am. I am the legend. They will write tales about. Oh, that the, the stupid land. The stupid land now kills me. Well, they're gonna write at least comments about this play. Well played, myself. Oh, oh, uh, I'm so. Oh, oh, that's that's so cool. Oh, enemy! How about I get another revitalize? <laughs> oh god! How many do I have left? One! One for the mo- Oh, he didn't even attack with that. If I do the math, then the math does not matter. Revitalize, boys! Watch! Uh, does this even do anything? Nope. Okay. Pretty unlucky, not gonna lie, boys. <laughs> Pretty unlucky. First of all, we were unlucky that he kept stalling Fey of Vicious, because that's the only card he can actually steal. Uh, second of all, pre unlucky because I am myself. A pretty awesome self, let's be real. A solid 10 out of 10 uh, hashtag would bang again. Uh, but, at the end of the day, I'm just... I'm just a demigod. You know, we also make not really mistakes sometimes, but yeah, it happens, boys. Okay, that was, that was, that was an experience. So let's just leave it at that, shall we? Chance for glory, shimmer, doom, scar, mirage. Dude! Man, that Liliana emblem, though, quite annoying. But we did not have Pact of Negation and whatnot. Our start was, like, iffy. So, you know. Ah, uh, how the hell did I not do that? Dude, all I needed to do was what 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 was break the land from doing anything and, and it would have been amazing, but ah, uh, well there's no there, there's no point in 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 being in the past, boys. The past is the past. No one will ever experience the past yet again. Also, seriously though, do I legit? No, I'm not gonna Doom Scott just yet. It's kind of pointless. Oh, a Gideon! Could you uh, giddy up? Okay, that's good. Let me think. I'm not actually thinking, but it's fine. <coughs> also, the hell are you using elves and red things together? Oh. Could pact of negation that, but I don't have a Gideon emblem. So maybe may, maybe tomorrow. What is that? The faceless realm walker? Oh wow, this guy oh, boys, look at this! This th this classic Franny is going all in. Wow, he's probably pretty proud of his achievements currently. But all of your achievements are kinda garbage, not gonna lie. Okay, there you go, enemy kun. I hope you had fun, because I sure as hell did. Oh, what are you gonna play? Tell me. An elvish wife. Okay, that's pretty good. Mwah. Love you, girl. Okay, okay, now this is actually problematic. <clears throat> let, let me think. Ah, 
there is a chance that we can actually just plus one that. Well, first of all is Shimmer of Possibility. Okay, Shimmer of Possibility was good, because I was kind of looking for the land. Okay, so now we do this. Nothing he does next turn actually wins. Okay, so we do this. And Gideon is fine, and then we can chance for glory. Mirari's Conjecture, two paths of negation. Essentially, enemy con can't even do anything. Ha ha! I negate, my lovely waifu. Oh, I'm guy. I am. I am such a sinner. Okay. Well, what now, enemy con? What now? Yeah. Think about it while you think about your uh, very, very, extremely bad choices of avatar usage. Not gonna lie, disgusting. Okay. So, let's see, Pact of Negation. Right! Forgot about that one. <laughs> okay, so the game's clearly out to get me at this point. You, you, you can see it written in the stars above, my boys. You can literally feel it. It is, it is there. Wizards has their, their finger on me, and it's slowly enter entering my anal cavities. Currently, it's not exactly in, so I'm enjoying the playfulness. Uh, but, not gonna enjoy it for long, Wizards. How dare you? How dare you? Dude, what is this? Yeah, this is better. Question mark. Okay, let's see. Yeah, this is, this is technically a lot better. Uh, okay, so, uh, start off with this. Do I go for red or do I go for double white? Double white is always the answer. Okay, good. Look at that. He thinks that we're a very bad life gain deck. Well, he's gonna be shocked we're, we're a very bad whatever the hell else deck. Yeah, they're always shocked. Okay, let's see. Ah, oh, that's great. An aggro deck. Good thing we went for the double bite in that case. We have Shimmer of Possibility, so technically we at least should have a reasonable time. Oh, be- oof. Uh, library or graveyard? Ah, oh, do I need this? Okay, let's do it like this. Not using the emblem just yet, because technically it's not exactly worth it at the moment. So, that's good that we could nullify this thing's damage. Chandra Spiraling. Chandra has too many things. Including a split roast. It's fine, though. Okay. So, let's, let, let's think. This is an island. Dude, seriously, you're gonna go just all in on that, huh? Disgusting. Wait, yes, yes! My boy! Boys? My boy! Wait a minute. Okay. Oh, I got Pact of Negation. Suddenly everything's fine. Okay, do this. Yeah, I got Pact of Negation. I got Negation for days. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's it. That's exactly what I expected. Oh, I can't actually cast this because Red Land. Um, in that case, well, that's, that's, that's pretty bad. That's, that's pretty goddamn bad. Wait, why does opponent get a turn? Oh, because I did not finish it off. Right. Wait, he's like going pretty deep on this, huh? Am I dead again? Graveyard, transform. Fucking calculated, my boys. Calcul- See, this is why you do math. This is why you do math. Oh yeah, but yeah, at least we predicted that enemy was trying to do something extremely heinous to us. Yeah, well, that was not a the, well, honestly, that was not a hard prediction to make because he is a uh, aggro red deck, and aggro red decks, <clears throat> well, all they pretty much do is heinous, treacherous stuff that should be shunned upon by the wider Imperium. I I, I guess it's fine on one hand, you know. I, Tefari Avatar Aggro decks are gonna Tefari Avatar Aggro deck. So again, I do think it's technically fine. You know, you can't, you, you can't, you can't judge big bait, skeleton, you know, dumb, dumb stuff like that. Okay, let's see. So this could easily turn really good for us. 
Do it. Maybe I'm on Faith Vicious. Nah, I don't want Faith Vicious. No one wants Faith Vicious. Okay, let's do this. Let's see what we got. We can still Faith Vicious later if we want to. Okay, technically useful. Yeah, boy, that's an animation. That's actually a good animation, also. Okay, well, thinning out the deck. Can't exactly say no to that. Okay, let's see. So, also, we only have one red land. Kind of like disgusting. Okay, let's see. A Doom Scott. I'll honestly take it. This gives us time. And I like time. You know why I like time? Because I like time. Also, this is gonna be on 3 HP, which means it's killable. Oh, he's going pure facial expressions, huh? Cools. Okay, make the land, like, very weaker than it already is. That's fine, that's fine. Okay. If I... What do I even go for? Anakin, please, you just need to press one stupid button. I understand you're the Tefari Avatar playing the uh, an aggro deck, which is... The most ironic thing in the history of irony. But, at the same time... <clears throat> ooh! Look at that! That's, that's, that's really not, not, not impressive. Okay, let's do this. Let's see what we get. Ah, Mirari's Conjecture. It's about damn time, boys. Okay, do this. Was that smart? I think it was. You know what? Since I did it, I'm gonna say it was very smart, in fact. Not just smart, but like, ultra smart, you know? Very, like, m m big brain energy right there. You know, definitely, yeah, definitely big brain energy. Okay. So this gives us a chance to pretty much just win. Look at this, that's eight loyalty points on a Gideon. That is the most disgustingly loyal uh, side browns I have ever seen in my life. Okay, let's do this. What do we want? Mirari Conjecture. When do we want it? Presumptively, great, great usage of lands, by the way. Gameu. Like, super on point, not gonna lie. So on point, I almost, I, I, I almost shat myself. Okay, do it like this. Yeah, and then nothing special, just going infinity, boys, you know how it, be, how it is. Okay, that's kind of technically useful, I guess. Uh, do this. Okay, now we should be able to find more things that I like. And I like finding things that I like. None of this is things that I like, though. I will take the land. It does seem a little bit appealing. Okay, good. Now let's drop this. I have this land, so don't you worry, boys. I did everything correctly, as always. Okay, now do this. That's two extra turns. Ah... When the plan comes together, keep pressing this because reasons. I still do not feel completely okay. Ooh. Okay, that's this, that's that. Let me think. Shimmer of possibility, yes, that's very shimmerful. Okay. So, we're gonna obviously do this now. Why? Because we have this card right here. And then we're gonna go for the Omniscience. This is gonna double it up. And now we have achieved infinity. Oh yes, the glories of infinity. The glories of stuff happening. Ah, oh, it's truly a magnificent process. It is truly what you call magnificent. Okay, now Gideon can turn into a human again. Also, notice the bugs. There's, there's still bugs in this play about uh, pretty much anything well anything in this game okay let's see what do i want Mira uh, mirari's whatever when do we want it technically it doesn't matter we have infinity time to actually make it happen also play this make everything a little bit more easy in life and now boys we're not did you did you think uh, did you think our vengeance was done savior no wrong side of history though Mate, would those words actually be bad for YouTube? I don't know. Pad of XL references, by the way. If you do not know what that is, well, congratulations, casuals. Well, actually, if you don't know what that is, you probably stopped playing, like, I don't know, five minutes into the game. 
Ah, uh, good stuff. Anything. You know what I should do? Probably drop the Fey of Fishes. Probably should just drop the Fey of Fishes to make this a little bit faster. We're, we're winning next turn, so technically... Well, not next turn. Oh, but the turn right after whatever happens. And he just explodes! Oh, yeah, boy. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. See? I may have lost the first two games because of extreme unforeseen circumstances. But when it comes to it, your boy delivers. That's right. Remember this. Because your boy delivers. Yeah. Well, onward we go. It's gonna be a wild ride, boys, so keep it steady. Also, as you can probably see, we are going back to infinity. And I have been thinking, you know what we have not done in a long time? Infinity Mana! You, well, not in, well. technically, I have an idea with Infinity Mana. For a while now. I just haven't gotten to it, because there's still so many things that we want to do. Muldraka the Grave Tide decks, boys. There, there's like a list and it just keeps on... Oh god, Tempo Blue. Dude, why do Tempo Blue players so often use uh, this land? Or there was uh, uh, some other... Oh, wait, 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 Nani? Oh, you're even worse than Tempo Blue. Got it. Got, got it, enemy con. Got it. Well, I am gonna pack the negation, the thing that you're gonna play, because I know what you're gonna play. You're gonna put the thingy on the wingy, cast the spelly belly, and pretend that your life is fine, even though you're a Tefari avatar. Does that target- oh god, whew, for a moment there I thought it maybe, maybe, just maybe. Does this- until prevent all damn- oh good, that's pretty cool. Okay, I like e that. I definitely like e that. Okay, so yeah, it will prevent all the wall damage. This is the dumb dumb deck. Oh, come on, god, enemy couldn't, like, relax. Can, can you please relax? I know that's bait, but I am a sucker for bait, boys. Uh, graveyard, thank you. And decline. Oh, decline for me, how quaint. Okay, good. So, now it actually at least makes it a little bit a lot more problematic for him to do this. Because this should uh, nullify the effect. And if it nullifies the effect, well, honestly, then enemy con does not have a great time. And I like it when enemy con does not have a great time. It makes me feel warm inside when someone's not having fun. You know, you can call it petty. You can call it whatever. But at the end of the day, boys. Yeah, it's actually just petty. But it's fine! Okay, let's see. How many cards do you think he will use? I'm just gonna go for the mythos for no reason. Yeah, that's the stuff. Mythos for no reason. Okay, flipping the Ascanta can play a Fey of Fishes. Look at this dude. He definitely has the thing, but he can't get rid of the Gideon for now. Huh? Oof. Yeah, well, enemy con. Yeah, you tried. That was cutesy. And by the way, enemy con, you do understand you actually need to kill the Gideon, right? Maybe he has a pushback. Maybe he's banking all of his stuff on a pushback. Disgusting. <coughs> I think I feel a little bit... Yeah. Sniff dead, boys. Do you feel it? Oh, yeah, that's that's the classic yet fantastic feeling of desperation right there. I, 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 I can 100% attest to that. Okay, uh, Pact of Negation, I'll honestly take it. It's pretty, free, pretty much free real estate, you know? Okay, let's see. Oh, a chance for glory! Don't mind me, boys! Just, just having the time of our lives! Uh, attack? Yes, attack. Let him feel. Let him know how it is. Okay, enemy could. You're probably really happy about something. Oh, an arc like Phoenix! Disgusting! Play it, no one cares. Jesus Christ, get a life. Wow! 
Up, uh, I don't know what that is. A Pikachu, we call it usually here. <clears throat> Wait. <gasps> oh, no. It actually hit get Nice. Okay. Wait, was there supposed to be a downside to hitting Gideon? Kind of feel like that wasn't. Kind of feel like that wasn't. Okay, it doesn't matter what we do here, by the way, like this. Okay, we can use this also next turn, which is Sugoi. Okay, Doomscot. Yeah, Doomscot seems very much on point here. Okay, extra turn. Well, more Doomscots, boys. Doomscot for the... Why is this invulnerable? Chance for glory makes things invulnerable? Oh my god! Who would have thought? That's... That's pretty okay? Not gonna lie, boys. That is actually pretty okay? Wow, I did not know that. Even though I use chance for glory a lot. Uh, but that's fine. Okay, wow. <laughs> yeah, she... Chance for glory! Turns out it makes your creatures invulnerable. Who would have thought again? That's that that's that's pretty insane. You know what else is insane? An impact of negation for freebies. Uh yeah. <clears throat> and there he goes, boys. He explodes. Man! I use chance for glory I have used chance for glory so much, but I never knew it had indestructible. Man! My brain's going poof right now. That's so insane. Wow. Well, it is what it is. Okay, you know, as always, boys. Another day, learn something new. That, ironically, I should probably have known like a year ago. Oh, but it's fine. So, yeah, this is the deck. This is, the, this is what you call a Gideon Infinity deck. As you can see... It's extremely convoluted, but trust me, boys, as the time progresses, we're going to be making more convoluted things that make absolutely no sense at all. And that's going to be great. Oh, yes. Has anyone of you ever thought what happens? I'm just going to show you the idea. I'm still working on the, uh, on the jits and uh, on the small jitters. But yeah, have you ever thought what happens when you use uh, Mythic reflect Reflection with uh, Nyx, uh, Nyx Bloom Ancient? You know? Well, on a Nyx Bloom Ancient, I, I should rather say. On an... Where is Nyx Bloom Ancient? Oh, because I, I clicked Colin him. Okay. Have, have you ever thought what happens when you, when you combine those... Where is Nyx Bloom Ancient? Somewhere here. Don't, do not play games with me, game. I am a uh, impatient man. Actually, I'm pretty patient. I am a pretty patient man. Okay, where is next bill mentioned? It should be here. But it's not. Oh, here it is. What happens when you use that, next bloom ancient, in combination with something as abysmally reasonable uh, as anointed presence? And a helm of the host with the most. Have you ever considered what happens then? Because I have. Oh yes, I definitely have considered what happens then. And what happens if you combine that with a little bit more on top? Oh boys. We're, we're just gonna... We're, 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 we're doing stuff. Don't ask me what. I don't know how good it's gonna work, because obviously I do make some uh, some some deck ideas like this, but I do try to make them practical, more practical than, hey, one in ten turns it's gonna happen type of deal. I actually try to make decks that, you know, are not just gonna be a one in ten, wow, that was great. So yeah, anyway, so this is the deck. <clears throat> Ne uh, next up is gonna be most likely Moldroha, the Grave Tide, uh, Grave Tide deck, because well, there are a bunch of good sagas. Why can't I find them all? Oh, because it was like this. 
Was this the color of Muldroha? Was it 7 cost? DUDE! Oh, sorceries. I guess that's fine. Okay, uh, I, yeah, it was 6 cost. Yeah, this was. Muldroha got the grave tide. If you do not know, there's this old but gold combo with Muldroha the grave tide and this one cost enchantment for uh, from Black Kai's Ghost form. That's a pretty neat thing. And there's honestly very good sagas that allow you to ramp and do other things that can easily be combined with the deck. So yeah, I think it's gonna be fun. Anyway, so this was Kuzer Sensen. Thanks for watching, subscribe if you haven't already, check out the channel, check out uh, the Discord, check out the Patreon, check out the everything, and have a nice day, bye bye!